few thoughts on uh, Colorado, Oregon. Um, remember, Dion announced he was leaving Jackson State. People were mad. It's like, hey, how can he do those boys like that? He committed to them in Jackson State. A lot of them followed him to Colorado. Colorado was a horrible program last year. One win last year. One. All the pundits said, if he wins two or three, he'll be lucky. He just got rid of 50, 60% of his roster. There's no way he wins more than one or two games. Nobody was expecting great things from the Colorado program anyway. Colorado program wins wins the first game. They're like, oh, snap, okay, TCU, we see you. And that was a big thing because TCU was basically returning a goodly amount of their players from last year's national championship team. Move forward to next week. They beat Nebraska. All oh, shucks. Then they beat Colorado State behind the whole wall. Take off your glasses and hat when you talk to me in the controversy. And the Travis Hunter hit. By the way, Travis Hunter, rest up and get better, young man. We hope to see you back on the gridiron very soon. Um, but when you think about it, they were supposed to beat Nebraska. They were supposed to beat Colorado State. With the with the improved level of play that they had just by the addition of the new players, they were supposed to win those two games. Maybe nobody expected them to beat TCU, but I'm going to tell you something. On paper, before Dion took the job at Colorado, I would have looked at that and said, that game against Oregon is a loss. As a Georgia fan, I know what Dan Lanning is capable of as a coach. As a SEC fan, I know that Bo Nix is a good quarterback and it was in a bad program. They weren't supposed to win this game today. So if you're out there and you're going, ha ha, that's what Dion gets. That's what you get for being cocky. I'm just going to say this. They weren't going to win that game even if somebody else was coaching. Okay? It wasn't going to happen. So everybody calm down. Go back to your corners. Sit down. Pop you some pop. Hey, look, I'm going to pull a lane kiff and pop you some popcorn and watch the game and enjoy it. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. We'll see you later. Go dogs.